Cool. All right, we have Amandine and Donna. Um, Caleb, we should start with you again. Should we? You want me to hand? Uh, congratulations on your goal. Uh, can you kind of take us through that and what, what, what were your what were the emotions like uh, after that goal? So like I was really really happy with that goal, but like we were like still losing in a in a way. So I was like keep that take that ball, go back, and we go again. So I didn't think about like oh I scored like go we need to go we need to go. So yeah. And then for for both of you, what what you you had the goal it seemed like maybe you can make a comeback. What do you guys feel like uh, kept you short of of making the full comeback to tie the game tonight? So I think like um, the first half was like not good enough and then they scored twice and I think like we didn't deserve that. And then the second half we came back, we created so many chances and then it's like so annoying that we didn't win today and I think we deserved it, what I said. And yeah, now we keep on going, we work on the good things and then next week we have to win. Yes, I have the same feeling, so we keep going. Uh, we are young, we have uh, to learn uh, for the first half. Um, the high level, it's uh, more like uh, small details. So if we want to win, we, we have to score and uh, we have uh, to stay uh, on clean sheet for sure. So we still uh, we keep going and uh, we learn. Yes. We talked to Coach Fred a little bit about halftime and his message to you as a halftime. Um, uh, uh, what was it like having a different coach tonight and what was his, me his message to you at halftime? So like I didn't feel a difference today because we didn't we we didn't know like what we need to do today. So we worked on that the last week with Amy, with Fred as well. So everybody was on the same page with that. And the second in the half time, like everybody was like, "Come on, we are better than them." So like keep on growing and we can do this. And that's what like the mindset we went outside again. And yeah, that's what we showed. Yes, I think uh, we miss Amy for sure. But uh, Fred uh, and all the staff, uh, they are on the same page. And uh, at the halftime, uh, Fred uh, told, uh, told them, uh, we, we, we keep going because uh, I think uh, the first half, it was not horrible, but uh, we miss uh, two, two things and the score. So he said, uh, we, we have uh, to press, we have to score, and uh, we tried, but it was enough. Don, I hope this isn't too creepy. I met your father at the home opener, <laughs> and we became fast friends, and so I've been texting with him on games like this. I want you to know he was watching yeah. this morning for him. Yeah, He's very proud of you. He is. How does it feel to be back after the injury and to score a goal the first game back? I was really excited for today. Like I was out of the game for two weeks, and I was like so happy that I could play today. And then I scored, so I was like, yeah, it was uh, amazing for me today. But I am a, a person who always want to win, so yeah, that was sad for me that we didn't win today. But we keep on growing, and then next week we go, that's what I said. Yeah, thank you. Amandine, um, you mentioned a minute ago with Caleb that there are a few small things that you think that the team could improve on. Would you mind touching on what you see as a savvy veteran? What are some things that you think that would just be the next step realistically? I think the next step is to score, <laughs> for mm -hmm. sure, <laughs> for sure. Because uh, when you lost, uh, the uh, the more difficult is to to be to stay on confidence. Uh, so uh, tonight, I I proud I proud of my of my team. Sorry, <laughs> because I think uh, we when we, um, you watch the game, I think uh, we we were be better. So sometimes uh, the football is cruel. We lost. And uh, it's why uh, we keep growing, and um, we we have to learn about um, what we missed. I hope this isn't too pedestrian of a follow-up, but when you talk about scoring just being the next logical thing, what do you see that would potentially get us into better positions for shots on goal? What do you think are the just the again next little steps, next little things? Is it just getting gelled together as a team, more used to one another's runs? What what do you see? I think yes, uh, we have we have to be more killer on the on the box, um, for sure, and uh, killer on our box too, for to be to be safe. Yes. And uh, yes, I, uh, it miss a little a little a little bit things, but these things it's uh, the detail for to win. Yeah, yeah. I totally agree. With you like it's about the details now. 
like we worked on a lot of things last week and we improved on that but like it's a small detail <coughs> where are you going into the box who's going to the first post who's going to the second post i think if we improve that we we're gonna score for sure uh, donna congrats on your first goal in the league Thank uh, you. and everything is a pretty stunning strike but i feel like the setup was maybe just as good the cross by ali and 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 whatnot from my bird's eye view way up here it feels like really good things happen when she when ali center is on the ball are you kind of figuring that out where like she's going at goal you kind of need to just, just start making runs and that's sort of, like what can you say so like, about her she's not so really like working. she's a great player um i love to play with ellie and normally i'm like oh ellie has the ball she can go she can score mm -hmm. so i don't have to run into the box today i was like oh let me make that run and then she played me it was a great ball and i only have to touch inside my foot and then it was a goal but it was a great ball for ellie Well, Dana, congrats on, on your goal. Uh, in the past, I see that you were a little bit frustrated with uh, the way that the team play. You want to win, obviously. Today doesn't happen, but how do you feel about your first goal and the, the feeling of do it before, after an injury? <laughs> First of all, I want to say, like, of course, I'm frustrated, not that my teammates, I'm frustrated that we didn't win today because we deserve it. I'm proud of the team, like how we fight today, how everybody was pushing and going for every ball um, for myself, like after an injury, coming back and scoring. Yeah, that's amazing, of course. Uh, this is like your fourth game on the league. Uh, how is the adaptation going to you? I think maybe that was my best game so far, so maybe the concussion was good for me, for my head and for my body, I don't know, but like, I feel I'm getting used to the league, um, to the speed and to the intensity, and I, I really like it. Amandine, uh, this was your first game against your teammates, um, it, and you have a week and a half in Utah. How do you feel about the playing against Angel City and your role in the Utah Royals? <laughs> Play against uh, Angel City, it was not uh, very well, for sure, because uh, it's, uh, they are my old teammates. But you know, when you play against your old teammates, you want to, 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 move, to see uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm good and uh, I want to win. Uh, yes, for sure. But I think it's uh, with uh, Utah, I'm, I'm so good. Uh, I feel very, very good with my teammates, with the staff, and my role is it's, it's to be a leader, I think, because my experience. So um, I try to be, on a, to be a leader on the field and without of the field. Maybe uh, my English is not very well, so I tried. <laughs> <laughs> I hope uh, they un understand me. <laughs> so yes, but uh, it's crazy because, you know, we lost, but I enjoy to play with my team I, and, uh, and I pride of my team and um, I believe on my team. And uh, yes, I, I do it everything for this, this club. Yeah. Hey, well, I would also like to ask you about the Olympic Lyon because it's in the Champions League final. <laughs> yeah. You play with them. You won probably seven Champions League yeah. with Lyon. Um, how do you feel about how oh, well how was played in uh, Champions League finals and all the experience that you have uh, playing that, those kind of games? Do you share it with your teammates? Yes, uh, I tried to share my experience and to play uh, the Champions League. It was crazy and uh, play the final. But when I play one game, it's uh, like uh, always a final for me. <laughs> um, I'm, my mindset is to be the better every game, to be better every game. So um, I know uh, we have a young team, so I try to share, yes, uh, what is my feeling on the field and uh, without the field for to build together and to grow in together. Yes, for sure. Thank you. <laughs> We're happy to have you. <laughs> Anything from you, Alex, over the Zoom? Nope. All right. Thanks, Alvin Dean. Thanks, Donna. Thank you. Of course. You're welcome. <laughs>